what's going on? Just doing a little video here about the state of sand pollen here in the Pennsylvania, Ohio, West Virginia area from my point of view. Um, great, you know, 79 North had the pad. Our rate, our rate's down. Yes, they are down. Are we busy? No, not really. <laughs> You're not gonna come out here and find a sand job right this minute. Um, that's for sure. But you will, first of the year. The days of uh, the sand boom and all that, is they're over. Um, this is kind of the new norm, which is booming in January. Starting to slow down in August and September. And if you're with the right company, you'll keep working all the way up until December. You take a few weeks off and back at it January 1st. Now, this is the new normal that we're dealing with. Next year may be a little different. I don't know. Sand is up and down. Oil is up and down. It's always that way. Right now it's down, but it's down, but it leveled off. Um, for example, the, the pad that we're running, we were supposed to finish it up the first week of September. We were running, they were running 17 to 18 stages a day it out. Well, the next pad we're going to wasn't ready. So, what they did is they cut it down 20 trucks and 40 loads a day. So each truck gets two loads and they run Monday through Friday. Now, what that does is that extends as well until the middle of December. Everything is uh, got to pick back up. So the key is to make your money, which I didn't have a chance to do in the beginning of the year. Uh, luckily, I'm with a company that's pretty stable. They've been around a while. So they got work and they're just not adding trucks anymore. As far as the rest of the trucking industry, from what I understand and what I've read and seen, it's leveled off. Um, it's not all doom and gloom. Like a few YouTubers are trying to tell you. Place to any 
everybody is to get with a well-established company that has a proven long-term truck record. Truck record. Track record. Even through the slow times. Yeah, we see companies closing. Does it have to do with the market? No. <laughs> Come on. Come on, 2008 was way worse than what's going on right now because there ain't really ain't much going on right now. In my opinion, these companies overextended themselves. They uh, forecasted incorrectly. Last year we know the rates were, were hopping. This year they're not. They kind of stabilized. industry is going to be just fine. There's companies still hiring. They're always going to hire. I just turned down the job. Just saying. Yo, oh my gosh, I got the odds. Y'all take it easy. <laughs> 